work right there. Let's put the water in there, maybe? I don't think that, that worked. Okay, time to reload. <laughs> Rat disappeared. There he is. I think we have to get him to actually go into the hole. Oh, ah! Oh, uh. I think we're supposed. I think this might be the fruit tree. It's like frozen inside this wall, and the rat's supposed to like go in there and get it. How the hell do we get him in there, though? That bird, though. This is the perch for it. Maybe the bird's supposed to scare the rat in there. Does the mask attract the bird? No, it's the prayer wheel. The prayer wheel. There we go. Uh. Oh. It's making an owl noise. Oh, there he is. Birdie! Um. Oh, well, we made him mad. <laughs> Strange bird, this harfang. Okay. Uh, oh, maybe we're supposed to throw the fish bone over there. Or what? What do we do? Oh, he's going in there. save right here. I think we may have to put water in this hole so we can, you know, it only goes in like one of the top holes. Perhaps we gotta take that and put it this one and then pour water down here no we did that wrong then let's reload okay let's stick it here oh it's gonna jump across water down here. Okay, let's back away and save again. <laughs> Didn't know the rat would be able to do this. Okay. Put the water in there. So he can like swim up there or whatever. What is she pouring it into? Oh, yep, that worked. Fuck yes. Oh, he's eating all the berries. I was gonna bring one to me. Yay. Huh. And it's gonna spill everywhere. I think I have to put the cork. Wait, what? Where would I have to put the cork? It doesn't go in there. It can go in here, though, but. Wait, what? Interesting. What the hell could we use? Slink? No. I'm pretty sure we were supposed to uh, get more water, but. 
I try re item first. Okay, a fish bone. There we go. Oh, we gotta give it a lot. <laughs> oh, yay, the berries. They're mine. Yay! We got the dream fruit. Awesome. Get the hell out of here now. It's a good thing those drum punchers didn't get stuck in the down position. I found the fruit of the spirit door. You want go, no doubting, Miss Walker. If it's the only way to bring back haunts. <laughs> good. Very good. Toot toot. Okay. It's kind of weird. God. We're back in that cave from the first game. It's just like a little bit weirder. Okay, there's something there. We got the mammoth doll again. So this is what our dreams are made of, huh? been really fast to make. It just like we retook it from the first game. We made it a slightly different color. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I don't have any problem with that, don't worry. like in the past or whatever that would be pretty orgasmic There's a person here is that Helena in her young ages she's wearing the gas mask hello hello miss oh no she's not my name's Kate Walker and I come from New York I'm Anna Anna Vorlberg I live here in Valadilen Ladeline. So it's not Valadeline. <laughs> it, like Kate Walker says it different than. Are That's you funny. Anna Vorlberg? Yes, miss. Vorlberg, like. Like my father, Rodolf Vorlberg. Hans Vorlberg and yourself are of the same family? Uh, uh yes. Or, uh, rather, um, I don't know. You are or you aren't. He's my friend, you know? Hans has no friends, miss. I would like to meet your father, Anna. At this time of day, he should be at home. Otherwise, he's always at the factory. Visitors aren't permitted to enter, though. Anna, do you know who this doll belongs to? No, but I know someone who'd definitely be interested in it. Are we near Valadilene? Yes, the town is down below. It's where I live with my father and brother. You know the Vorlberg factory? Yes. It belongs to our family. Dumb question to ask. Have you got a brother? Yes, but my father prefers me not to talk about him. 
Why not? Since his accident, my brother has changed. What's changed? Well, what's changed is that he has... I still love him, though. Where is he? Father sent him to the attic. He often punishes him. Hans does the most foolish things. Oh, he must be real unhappy. Not at all. He gets a bit of peace up there. He invents automatons, ones with no discipline, no method, as father might say. See you soon. See you, miss. All right, let's go look for him. It's up in the attic. Hmm. Very interesting. Can't go that way, that's good. It's good that it's fairly linear. Otherwise I'd be getting lost. I think this is where the house is. So he's up in the attic. We have to go in through the front door. Holy shit. Whoa. This is a different area. Never been through here before. Oh, you're the father, huh? Please, Mr. Varlberg, sir. Ah, you're the new chambermaid, I presume. <laughs> well, it's about time. I'll be giving you instructions when I get back from the factory, and until then, I... Ah, uh, excuse me, sir, but I am not a servant. Well, uh, who are you, then? Kate. My name is Kate Walker. I'm a friend of your son, Hans. Look, miss. To my knowledge, Hans has no friends. That boy is a complete misfit. I can assure you I am, Mr. Varlberg. Miss, the boy who yesterday was my son, today is but a puppet of himself, wound up in his strange obsessions and his queer pet hobbies. That boy only has one friend, and that friend is trouble. Wow. <laughs> Would it be possible to see Hans, please? Impossible. He's being punished in the attic. Thank you for telling Sir, me where he is. It's very important. Miss Hans has been sent to the attic until further orders. I don't want him getting up to any more harebrained mischief while I'm at the factory. You're going back to the factory? Yes? Of course. Like every day. Is Hans going with you? Not on my life. The boy has lost all sense of discipline and method. And discipline and method are the primary qualities of any self-respecting automaton manufacturer. Goodbye, Mr. Varlberg. Goodbye it is, Miss Walker. Okay. What an asshole. Oh, this is like a different angle. What the hell? What's up with this clock? Three for it's two forty five. That might be important. It's locked. Nothing I can do. It's locked. No. Oh, that looks that direction. Okay. Well, is the lower part different? It is. This thing's stuck. Shit. This thing's. Yeah, 
it's only gonna do anything, is it? How about this now? This thing's stuck. This thing's. Okay. This thing. This. Huh. I don't understand. This thing. Can we look, keep looking around? Because apparently this thing's stuck. Okay, we can't go that way. Other directions we can go this way. It's pretty cool. <laughs> this way goes nowhere. Okay. Then we can go. I think this way goes to the factory, so let's head that way. Okay, well, apparently we can't go this way either. What the fuck? Okay. There's one other way we could go. And it's this way. That's the hotel I stayed at. We keep going. Pretty much the church, it seems. Well. <laughs> Not really, apparently. It's as far as it'll take us. So it has to do with that clock, then. See if she has anything new to say. Anna? Yes? Do you know what time your father will return to the factory? Yes, at 7.15 exactly. Thank you very much. Oh. Okay, okay, I think I know what to do. Okay, 7.15, we gotta remember that. Okay, we just gotta make that clock strike 7.15, and I guess it'll go ding, ding, ding. It's like an alarm clock, maybe? We got this shit. Easy peasy. Alright, so... Um, 7.15, is that it? This thing's... This thing... Um... Thinks it's 2.45 still. This thing... Five, six, seven. That was seven fifteen, right? Six, seven fifteen. Okay, let's see if he full. Well, maybe we gotta talk to him again. So we're at seven fifteen. Sorry to disturb you, sir. I... What is it now? I've got to talk to Hans, sir. No. For the last time, it's out of the question. The clock in the hall doesn't seem to work. Time, miss. Just when you think it's going nowhere, <laughs> it starts slipping away like sand through your fingers. Goodbye, Mr. Varlberg. Goodbye it is, Miss Walker. Huh. Wait, oh, that was just him. Maybe it works now? This thing's... This thing... What the hell? Makes no sense. Maybe we gotta get to say the same time as the one above, so... That. This thing's. This thing. It said 2:45, didn't it? I think so. I think that's 